It's an exciting collection that's, and what makes it come alive is the fact that it's working. So we can engage on American world history, great inventions and inventors, and all these different stories because we pull people into that story with the working machines and telling some uh, colorful uh, anecdotes about what happened in history using the printing press. Leland, I understand that uh, you are indeed printing a very important document here today. Right. This is the printed uh, Declaration of Independence. It was actually done before the written uh, example that we're all used to seeing. And the purpose of doing this was to distribute it to the colonies as well as to use as posters to be plastered all over town declaring that we are independent. This is our Independence Day celebration featuring Ben Franklin, Thomas Jefferson, John Adams, who we describe as the Confounding Brothers. And they tell a rather colorful and lighthearted story about what it took to create the country and some things that might have happened otherwise. And the guests get to interact with, uh, with Franklin and his friends. And we have a, a whole host of colonial characters and some from the French court have come over today to join us and entertain our guests. Basically, it's a very uh, brief play, about 40 minutes, about a meeting between Franklin, Jefferson, and Adams and about their role in the Declaration of Independence. And yes, we have humor thrown into it. Uh, in fact, the Declaration was created in more than likely in, in about three weeks through the courtesy of Doctor of our good friend Thomas Jefferson, who actually produced the goodly work. I just changed a few rephrasings, and so did Mr. Adams. It was the committee that did the real vivisection, as we would say. So, so you enjoy editing things out. Well, being a printer, it comes naturally to me. We are celebrating Independence Day at the International Printing Museum in Carson, California, here on another edition of Out and About with Roger Martin.